Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a long time. I oh gosh, I'm I've been missing in action here on YouTube. I mean, I've been kind of you know posting um, pictures on Instagram, and not daily, but like you know pretty often. Like like I told you guys, I think on my last video, I've been a lot more active on Instagram lately than here on YouTube, just because filming a video takes a lot more time and preparation and you guys know that. So anyways, um, well, especially if you make videos, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. And I don't really edit my videos, I used to, but I don't really do much editing anymore. Uh, but you know, it still takes time, you have to film it, upload it, you know, uh, and all that stuff. So anyways, I'm here with baby. I was gonna say Maddie, but yes, it's a Maddie's called by Bonnie Brown, but her name is Erin. I named her Erin. And look how sweet she looks. I don't know. I don't think you guys saw this outfit here uh, on the channel. If you follow me on Instagram, you might have seen a couple pictures that I posted of her with this cute outfit that says, you're my main squeeze. And it has like a lemon there with sunglasses and the uh, kind of gingham like shorts. Look how cute she looks. Oh my gosh. I uh, actually, I should take more pictures of her on this outfit, but maybe I'll do that some other time. Lucas has my, has my phone, by the way. My son has my phone, so I cannot take pictures right now. But I wanted to film this video. We have pretty decent lighting right now. I hope it's showing nice on camera. Anyways, guys, I have a little haul video for you, and I'm gonna change it as well at the end of the video, or maybe, okay, no, yes. Okay, I'm gonna change her first, and then I'm gonna show you the um, the whole like all all the outfits that a friend of mine from the community got for me. She went to Once Upon a Child a couple of weeks ago, I think, um, and she found some. I sent her some money. Uh, she said she was going, and you know, she asked, "Hey, is anybody want me to show for your babies?" Da 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 da. And I said, "You know what? Maybe I should get some outfits for Erin because." Erin is my biggest baby in my collection and so I don't, uh, the thing about her is I don't shop, I don't have many clothes for her just because she cannot share clothes with anybody else in my collection. I have a big collection you guys but she cannot share clothes with anybody so you know I, that's why she doesn't have any Lulu for example <laughs> because Lulu is expensive and you know I want her to be able to share like you know, I, I don't want to spend so much money for an, on an outfit that just one doll in my collection can wear. So anyway, so let me show you. This is a, one of the outfits that she got for me, and this is what I'm going to change her into today. Look how cute this dress is. With like, uh, like blue, pink, and green, and these flowers here. I thought since we're still in May, you know, springtime, this would be a perfect outfit for now. I have another one that I really, really like, and I'm going to show you. But that, that one is more for a summer, so I'm gonna have to wait a little bit. And these are the bloomers, kind of, you know, like the diaper cover to put on her. Give me one second, I have to get a pair of scissors because I just realized that. <laughs> Hold on. I forgot to remove the tags from the outfit. <laughs> so, yeah, so thank you so much. Sorry for taking the time to shop for my Maddy. She also sent me a couple outfits, I think, on three month size. That would be nice for Sunny Grace for my penny sculpt, uh, which I also haven't been buying things for her. I mean, the good thing about Lulu though is the newborn, like, or newborn to three month size, like, it's so stretchy. Lulu clothes are so stretchy that both my three month size babies and my newborn babies can wear them so that's cool um but i still i still have been kind of I, i've been gravitating towards the newborn size babies lately um just i think because you know there's they're smaller they're easy to take with you places like if i want to put one of them on my one of my uh dolly bag give me one second oh my goodness I'm gonna have a hard time getting this off of her. I think this is size six months, and this girl can wear size even nine months uh, very well. She's a big girl, guys. She's a big girl. If you have a Maddie scope, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> so, yeah. And she has very chunky thighs, 
So it's like for some things she's, you know, six months. Like on the top, I would say she's she can wear six months size. <clears throat> but if she has, if she was wearing like leggings, or even if she's wearing like a sleeper, I I buy like nine month size sleepers for her. So yeah, let's see how adorable this dress looks. Okay, we're gonna put the diaper cover first. So guys, I've been so busy with the puppies. Oh my goodness. It's like I went from having one toddler to three toddlers. <laughs> you know? Like I don't like crazy from one day to another. It's been crazy. That's why I haven't been filming much at all because I've been busy with that then Lucas got sick Lucas uh, Lucas started feeling sick I think it was Thursday night he started getting like a cold he slept really badly uh, we all slept badly by the way not just him um, and then Friday I let him stay um, home from school because yeah he was just congested he you know he wasn't feeling well at all and it was gonna be a short day as well because they had professional development and I said I don't want to send him to school and maybe then they call me half an hour later saying he has a fever or something and I have, and have to go get him you know so I, t I talked to the teacher and I, I told her look he did he doesn't feel good uh, so I think I'm gonna let him stay home and she said oh yeah that's totally fine like uh, even if he doesn't have a fever he could still come but if he doesn't feel good she said he is not gonna um you know give me one second guys I'm sorry he's not gonna get you know as much like from school as he would if he was feeling fine so so he stayed home uh, he's doing much better um, this cold doesn't seem as bad as the one he had when he first started school. I don't know if I told you guys, but the second week, like he started school and the second week he got super sick and he missed the whole week, I think, because he got sick like on a Sunday night <laughs> and he was feeling very, very sick, like almost a whole week. Like it took him a full week to recover. This time is not as bad, I don't think. Um, I think I'm going to send him tomorrow. We'll see. Uh, he was having a pretty bad cough, um, and this is a Lulu bow, by the way, which I think is gonna. It doesn't. It's not the perfect match to this light blue, but it matches pretty nicely. I think it's gonna look super cute, super cute on her. So yeah, he had a pretty bad cough last night. I'm running out of cough syrup, so I have to get that today. Uh, and hopefully, you know, if he's not coughing as much. Uh, he's pretty good now. He's pretty good now. He's coughing here and there, but not much. Oh my god, how cute she looks, you guys. She's so cute. Look at this girl. I love the hair on this doll. Oh my gosh. It's so soft. So cute. And here's the bow. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Give me one second. Let me put her... Oh, wait a minute. Actually, okay. Yes, I'm going to move her. I'm going to show you her a little bit closer and then I'm going to move her and I'm going to show you the rest of the haul. But look how beautiful she is, you guys. Those blue eyes are so cute and they, I think this dress um, makes them pop too. Look how adorable. Okay, yeah, so I'm going to put her away for now. Oh, gosh, she's heavy. And I'm going to show you the rest of the haul and then I'm going to come back. Oh my gosh, she looks so cute, you guys. Just wait till I show you. <laughs> um, and then I'm gonna show you like a better view of Maddie. Give me one second. And I keep calling her Maddie, even though her name is not Maddie. <laughs> Maddie is one of my Tink's tink babies, actually. Okay, so let's see. So let me show you the next outfit. This outfit, I love it. Thank you so much, Tori. Yes, it does remind me of Florida because it has the flip-flops. And you know, I miss Florida so much. My goodness, I regret moving back up north, honestly, guys. <laughs> I do. Not at this time of the year, though, because the weather is beautiful right now. But when the winter comes and we spend like six months like locked up inside because it's so cold and snowing and... Oh, 
I wish I was in Florida. But anyways, um, hopefully we'll be able to visit sometime when they don't require a mask on the plane anymore because uh, my son Lucas has sensory issues and there's no way he will tolerate a mask uh, for so many hours. So anyways, look how cute is this outfit. This is also for Maddie for, well, for Erin. And it has those flip-flops there and it has this bow here, super cute. I really like it, really like it. Um, then this dress here, I think this is an extra that she sent me because I don't remember seeing this on the haul. It's by Sarah Louise. They have, oh wow, and it's made in England and everything. This brand, I think I used to have, I have somewhere, somewhere I have a dress by this brand and they have really nice kind of vintage looking dresses super cute and it has like a flower over there really nice uh, oh this one is one of my favorites you were right yes I do love this one you know I love anything with dogs on it like dogs cats especially dogs I'm a sucker for for animals <laughs> for dogs especially um, yes so look at this how cute this is by Disney baby Oh my gosh, she's gonna look so cute. I was gonna put this one actually now, but like I said, because you know, it's, it's May, we're still in spring, I said, I think I'm gonna put that dress. It's, it's like, you know, special for spring. But sometime soon, I think, when I change her out of that dress, I'm gonna put her on this cute overall with the polka dots, and it has um, a little doggy there. So cute, I think it's from the Dalmatians, if I'm not mistaken. And it says, little one. Yeah, that's so cute, so, so cute, super cute. I really like it, yeah, you were right, this is one of my faves. Um, then she sent me, this is newborn size, even though it looks kind of a little big, I think Sunny Grace could fit on this too. Um, this is super cute, and it has like cactuses and some pinks and flowers on there, super nice. This is by, uh, okay, it says Subel's Natural, 100% organic cotton. Yeah, this outfit, this, I, I love rompers. This is like a romper. I love rompers on babies. I remember when Lucas was a baby, I used to have him, and we were in Florida, I used to have him in rompers all the time. So cute. Um, it's such a cute outfit. Like, it looks nicer than it once, in my opinion, you know? Uh, it's simple, but it's, I don't know, it's a little bit cuter, like if you're going to be out and about. And it's so easy for diaper changes and all that. Then she also sent me these. Um, this is 0 to 3. And this is like a top. It has like a bear, like a teddy bear, and like a bunny. And it's like baby blue. How many minutes? Oh my gosh, 13 minutes. I took so much, guys. <laughs> I'm sorry. And last but not least, oh gosh, I love this one. This is the three month size. This is gonna be nice for Sunny Grace. A very cute pink, baby pink, very light pink slipper with those flowers there on the top. I really, really like this one. And then it has the cute little bows there on the feet area. Super, super cute. So thank you so much, Tori, again. Thank you so much. Um, and I'm not sure because I think she was going to change her channel name or like she was going to make a new channel. I think I'm going to ask her before posting this video maybe what her channel is now or like what channel she wants me to put the link for on my description box. Um, I'm going to ask her just to make sure. But um, yeah, guys, so you can, you know, follow her channel. I don't think she's very active on YouTube right now. I maybe i don't know i'm not sure but I, she's very active on on instagram and that's where i follow her um so yeah so anyways uh give me one second let me hold on let me show you this beautiful girl oh my god she is so cute look at those eyes i gotta try to take some pictures of her guys look how cute that dress looks on her she looks adorable. What I love about this scope, about this baby, is I love taking pictures of her with the smaller babies. And she looks so cute. She looks like an older sister. You know, she looks like a big sister. She is so cute. I love her. I, gosh, I love this dress. It's super, super cute. I love those flowers over there. 
it's I love it because it's kind of like vintage -y. I don't have many vintage things really for my babies uh, that's not usually what I would go for but there's so many cute things I mean gosh seeing her now wearing that dress she looks adorable guys she looks super cute look at that all right so i hope you enjoy my video i'm sorry that i rumble a little bit too much as usual <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed it and like i said make sure you follow me on instagram if you have an account my username is bundles of show 83 uh yeah follow me there because i'm a lot more active there uh, that's a little bit easier to uh, make time for you know when you have two crazy pups in the house um, you know, things are better, like Lucas is, I think I told you, I don't remember if I told you that Lucas was like jealous of the dogs when we first brought them home. He was jealous, he was jealous, he was like, he used to have all my attention and then suddenly these two crazy pups come in and, and you know, I, I had to dedicate a lot of time with them, to them and stuff and he was jealous, <laughs> like if I had brought a baby to the house. Uh, but now he's doing amazing. He loves him. You know, he understood that nobody's going to take his place, of course. Uh, and he's doing great. And the dogs have to still come down, have to learn to be more calm down when they're next to him because they're still crazy. And, you know, they shampoo him and just lick his face all over and, you know, um, all that. <laughs> but things are getting, you know, better. Um, they're still having accidents in the house, unfortunately. That's going to take a while. Uh, if you ever had a puppy, you know that that doesn't happen from one day to another and, you know, it takes time and time and patience and a lot of, um, you know, potty trips outside to teach them to go. So anyways, but yeah, so I've been busy, but things are good, guys. Uh, I also, I don't know if, did I mention that I got my second vaccine dose Friday? So yesterday I was feeling tired, super tired, and I had a pretty bad headache most of the day so I didn't feel like filming or nothing uh, but today I'm feeling great so yeah so I'm happy so now in like two weeks I should be considered fully vaccinated now so anyways guys thank you for watching I hope you're having a great weekend uh, and yeah don't forget to like share and subscribe and I will see you guys very soon on another video bye bye bye